Welcome back to SourceFed. I am Elliot Morgan. I'm Joe Beretta. Thanks for your time. So every year, a magazine called Maxim releases their Hot 100 list, which is exactly what it sounds like. It's a list of 100 hot women. What's cool about this list is you get to vote on it at Maxim.com. So yeah, I would say this is a pretty great nation. In case you've forgotten what hot looks like, here are the number one picks starting in the year 2000 until now. First up is Estella Warren. Hey, cool. I have no idea who that is. Yeah, she's best known for being voted number one in 2000's Maxim Top 100 list. In 2001, it was Jessica Alba, who was the youngest person at 20 to reach the top spot. I like her face more than I like her personality. 2002 was Jennifer Gardner. Oh yeah, she seems nice. Nice, whatever. 2003 was Christina Aguilera, so it's nice they're including men on this list. Hey, she's beautiful no matter what you say. I see what you did there. In 2004, Christina Aguilera was dethroned by Jessica Simpson. Blah, 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 dumb blonde joke. 2005 and 2006 were both Eva Longoria, who coincidentally was the oldest person to reach the top spot at 31. And the only back-to-back -back winner ever. Yeah. That's historical. Go girl. In 2007, we saw Lindsay Lohan take the top spot. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. 2008 was Marissa Miller. Thank you, 2008 voters. 2009 was Olivia Wilde. Thank you, 2009 voters. Olivia Wilde is the second reason I watch House, directly behind Hugh Laurie's snarky comments. And fun fact, she's nine feet tall. Fun fact number two, she used to be a princess. And she's a goat. That's not a fact. 2010 was Katy Perry. Uh, when she first came out, I was like, uh, I don't really get it, but now I'm like, I get it. Yeah, she's actually hot, despite looking like a little person in a big person's body. And in 2011, the girl to take the top spot was the one that replaced Megan Fox in Transformers 3. Last but not least, our prediction for the top spot in 2012 will be Lee Newton. That's right, and we're completely serious about this, we just need your help. Lee literally has no idea about this, but with your help and us, we can get her to the number one spot. Our decision to try and get Lee on this list is a direct result of the comments and feedback we've gotten from you guys and all the videos that we've done on SourceFed already. Specifically in two videos, the first being when we covered AskMen.com's 99 Most Desirable Women of 2012 and UGO.com's Most Desirable Fictional Women of 2012. The overwhelming response we got from those videos is that you guys thought the women were hot, but you thought Lee should be on the list. Well, here's your chance to get Lee on a hot woman list. And the fact that you actually get to vote for Lee means you could uh, potentially be making the news. Yeah, I mean, we're not telling you to vote for Lee. Vote for anybody you want, but vote most for Lee. Click the link down in the description below, go to the Maxim website, and you can vote as many times as you want. While you're voting as many times as you want, Vote for Lee. Before you do that, leave a comment down below. Tell us why Lee deserves to be in the top 100. Mm -hmm. And then go make flyers. And some internet memes would be good. Yeah. Click the like button for Lee's sake. Click the subscribe button for Lee's sake. Click this annotation bar for more stories concerning Lee. And I'm Joe Beretta. And I'm Elliot Morgan. And this is 20 Minutes for Lee.